Hola, Ángel. Good evening. Can you hear me? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, my friend. Are you ready for your presentation? Uh, yes, teacher. Okay, please go ahead. Uh, would you like to share your screen? ¿Le gustaría compartir su pantalla? Sí, en este momento voy a intentar. Vaya, okay, go ahead. No sé si ya pueden ver dicho la presentación. Uh, no, ya, my friend. Ahora sí, ya está cargando. Ok. Ahora sí, my friend, adelante. Ok, uh, okay. good evening. Uh, uh, my name is Angel. Uh, my topic is our verb of frequency. Uh, an order of frequency describes how often an action happens. Uh, there are eight main order of frequency that we use in English. These are always, usually, or normally, often, sometimes, occasionally, seldom, hardly ever, or uh, for any and never. Uh, meaning in Spanish, always, uh, siempre, usually or normally, generalmente or normalmente, often, a menudo, sometimes, uh, a veces, Occasionally, occasionalmente, seldom, rara vez, hardly ever, or, re, or rarely, casi nunca, never, nunca. Uh, some examples of the use of our verb of frequency. Uh, for example, uh, she always goes to the night club to dance. Uh, they usually quarrel. I normally go, go to the gym. Uh, they often go, go out for dinner. I sometimes go with my wife. Uh, I occasionally eat junk food. I seldom read the newspaper. I hardly ever drink alcohol. Uh, I never go to the cinema. I don't like it. Uh, esto sería um, 
En español significa, dice que los adverbios de frecuencia eh, describen un, este, eh, con cuánta frecuencia o qué tan a menudo se repite una, una acción. Este, y ahí nos da los ejemplos de los más utilizados en inglés. Eso es lo que, es lo que eh, tenía para presentarte. Hola, ya subo. Ángel. Eso era todo, Piché. Eh, who is the next one? Buen trabajo, Ángel. Thank you. Ok, gracias. ¿Quién va? Francisca, Francisco, Blanca, Marlon, Brian, Marvin. Mi teacher. Francisca, go ahead. Okay. No sé si ven la pantalla. No yet, my friend. Ahora sí, está cargando. Es Lore. Ok. Es que está un poco lenta esta máquina. No se preocupe. Ahorita. Ya, ya puedo ver. Ok. Hoy sí. Sí, respondan los demás, por favor. No se les oyó en clase. Ok. Yes, I can see. Thank you. Uh, good, good evening. Uh, uh, my topic is verb be and past. The past tense of this was or where. Uh, what is the difference between uh, was and where? It depends on the subject or who is talking. Uh, for example, uh, subject uh, I, he, she, it. That is us was for you for topic or oh, pardon so for a subject you we they is use where uh, example um, they were happy the boy was tired. Example sentence with, with was uh, the, uh, the boy was five, I was this uh, when you call me, how was your day? Example, 
a sentence when we were, they were happy, we were ready for the test, why were you hungry? Um, uh, siempre, uh, um, the subject I am positive was a negative was not a contract was sent and question question uh, is was I was I uh, subject you positive were negative were not in contract contraction uh, is uh, weren't and question were you uh, and subject he she positive was negative was not contract wasn't question was he she it um uh, we were positive were negative were were not contra weren't question were we and subject they positive were negative were not contract weren't question weren't they now we will have an um, interactive games One moment. Okay, please choose a number from one to 12. Please. Number four. Number four, okay. My dog in the garden this morning. Is was, is wasn't, were, or weren't? Repeat the question, please. My dog in the garden this morning. My dog uh... is was. Okay. <laughs> okay. Was. Okay, it's uh, vamos a repetir. The person. Repeat. Uh, please choose a number for from uh, one to twelve. Please. Two. Two. Okay. Uh, the lions at the zoo. Uh, num uh, option A, option B. Uh, repeat, please. Uh, no, no ve en la pantalla, compañero. Uh, no. No, no se solo mira. Lo, solo los oh, números I aparecen. Did, I did, sí. Permítame. No sé si se... Only number. Pues sí. ¿Se ve la pantalla? No. Yes, I see the numbers, but I don't see what are behind the numbers. Only numbers. 
Okay. Now, now, uh, see you. Oh, I see. How many oh, numbers? A... Number. Please choose a number from one, uh, one, uh, one to twelve. Number one, number three, number five, six. But seven. what appears there, Francisca? Appears there the answers or what is uh the game? I'm sorry yeah. because I can see, but I can see the numbers. One, two, three, until twelve. Okay. Yes. Uh, Pero no sé si la ven la pantalla. No se logra ver. Yes, I can see the uh the screen, but uh, tell me what do you try to do? Okay, entonces hay que hay que elegir la opción si es was o were. For example, um, hey. Pienso usted con uno a ver cómo cómo resulta. The gear eh uh, Eh, opción A, A, B, C, D. Por ejemplo, was. Ahí está. Ok. Correcto. Eh, oh, please show us a number from on the 1, 2, 12. Otra opción, otro número, please. Six, number six. Six, okay. Number six, it is now people can go along the court during the look dog. It possible. Uh, option A, option B, option C, option D. I don't read the ocean. Yes, we can. We can read uh, the answers or options. We only see the numbers. So let me numbers. Okay. <laughs> Se nos fue el tiempo. <laughs> eh, otra, otra opción, otro número. Uno más, uno más, y con este finish. Hay que elegir un número. Nine. What? What? Nine. Okay. Nine is I. I was, I were, I wasn't, no, I weren't. At, I, at school yesterday, I was at home. What is correct? A was. B were, C wasn't, D weren't. I was. No. <laughs> okay. Mm. Bueno, eh. Finish my presentation, teacher. Yes, oh, muy bien, my friend. Congratulations. Very good presentation. Okay. Thank you. Muy bonita presentación. Me encantó. Se ha preparado okay. muy bien. Sigamos practicando, por supuesto, pero hasta el momento le doy las gracias por la responsabilidad. Y muy bonita presentación. Ok, ya, ya me salgo. Gracias. Ok. okay. Thank you, my friend. Who is the next one? Blanca, Denny, Francisco, Angel ya presentó, así que Marlon. My friends, no les había dicho, discúlpeme, pero <coughs> estoy un poco mal eh, de la garganta. 
o no sé qué sea, pero amanecí con fiebre, dolor de garganta, dolor de cabeza, que no se me ha quitado. Así que that is the reason that I have, uh, that I don't have the camera on. Pero <coughs> estoy aquí eh, para escuchar su presentación, ¿ok? Las disculpas de mi parte, pero eh, es por fuerzas mayores, ¿ok? Eh, entonces, ¿quién va a ser el siguiente? Blanca, Francisco, a Marlon, Brian, Marvin. Yo puedo hacerlo, pero si escuchan interferencia y me disculpan. No se preocupe, adelante. Para presentar, sí, no sé cómo hacerlo. No sé si me ayuda. Sea de la computadora o del teléfono. Eh, ahí estoy en computadora. Sí. Ponga eh, share my screen. Así es que a usted cómo le sale. Es que yo como sí. soy el host, me sale diferente. ¿Cómo le sale a usted? Espero que Buddy no me quite el trabajo en el futuro. Creo que ahora sí. Ya, 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 ya puedo ver. Que Buddy hace Está perfecto. Una... Ya me aparece ahí la... una presentación. Estoy seguro de que lo amarán. Uh, no, excuse me, teacher. Good night. Good night, guys. Good evening. Uh, Remember, is this is for present. everybody. We say good evening. Good night is cuando ya nos vamos. Ya no nos vamos a ver. Good evening es cuando okay. voy entrando. Good evening. <laughs> Eso. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, guys. Joinepa. My topic is present perfect. For and sing. Y using the present perfect, we can define a period of time. Prior... Fíjese, eh, Francisco, perdón que lo interrumpa, pero no puedo ver su pantalla. La estaba viendo, no pero ya ver. no la puedo ver. No sé, los demás, confirmen, por favor. Sí se ve. Sí, sí se ve, Tisha. Sí se ve. Sí se ve, ok. Déjenme sí. ver por qué yo no. Pues ahí. Okay, adelante. Bien. Eh, this is my investigation. Present perfect uh, with four and things. Using the present perfect, we can define a period of time prior to the present moment. Considering its duration, in which case we use for more time period or it's managing or starting point in which case we do use things more specific moment for and thing can be used with the past perfect things only support perfect things for can is be used with the simple past For example, um, for more time periods. Example one, for six years. Example two, for a week. Example three, for a month. Example four, uh, for hours. Example five, for two hours. Um, a example more. I have worked here for five years. Uh, ex example, sign more concrete moments. Uh, example one, since this morning. Example two, since last week. Example three, uh, since yesterday. Example four, since it was a year. Example uh, five, since Wednesday. Example, uh, 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 seven, sign two o'clock. A sample more, I have worked here, sign things. Um, sería este, 19, 19, um, 
writing. Um, um, present perfect from present perfect with four. Uh, example, she has lived here for 20 years. Example two, we have out at this school for a long time. Example three, uh, Alice has been married for three months. Example four, they have been uh, that travel for a week. Example, uh, with present perfect with things. She has lived here since uh, 1980. Uh, example two, we helped out at this school site uh, in 1965. Uh, example three, Alice has been married since, since March Second example four, they they have been happy for things last Thursday. Here I hang my research. Thank you so much, teacher and uh, company. Thank you, Francisco. Think, Thank you, Francisco. I finish. Okay, my that is work. the end of the presentation. Very good job, my friend. Uh, congratulations. Uh, can you please send me that presentation to my uh, WhatsApp, please? Okay. Okay. Uh, Thank you, my friend. In that same moment. No worries. Uh, um, take your time. Ahora bien, Blanca, eh, los demás que faltan. Who is the next one? Me. Okay, go ahead, my friend. Eh, no puedo compartir ahorita. Eh, Francisco, pudiera quitar para poder presentar yo, por favor. <ríe> Vaya, ¿y cómo hago para ¿verdad? quitar? <ríe> ¿Y cómo eh, hago para... Ahí mismo donde dice compartir pantalla, de, dice este dejar de compartir. Ok, déjeme buscarlo. Perfecto. Creo que lo hice yo, ¿sí? Ah, yo bien. Estoy, ah ok. Va. Gracias, okay, gracias. Thank you. Teacher, teacher, dígame, eh, a su WhatsApp personal o al WhatsApp, sí, sí, grupo? sí, al personal, ok, please. Eh, no sé si lo pueden ver. Yes, yes we can. Yes, we can. Ok, thank you. Eh, my topic is eh, quantifiers in which we have a uh, match many, little, uh, a few. And are classified classify in no count, uh, nouns, e count nouns. How much, too much, a little is a no count nouns. And how many 
too many, too many. A few is a cow noun. For example, it is a no cow noun. A, the example, how much? It is a no cow noun. Es decir, que no se puede contar. How much yellow do you need me to buy? La gelatina, pues, obviamente no se puede contar. Y ahí dice, ¿necesitas más gelatina? Is a cow now. For example, the how many. How many much rooms? Creo me recuerdo que se pronuncia. Did you find? It is a cow now. Significa que son cosas que se pueden contar. Other example is a no cow now. You said to the too much. I think about, about too much crumb. Eh, el maíz eh, no es algo que nosotros podamos contar. Entonces podemos usar how much, too much, o a little. Eh, other example, cow noun. You said there too many. I eat too many beans. I know I have a stomach. Comí muchos frijoles. No me cayeron bien en el estómago. O no me, no me sentaron bien, podría decirse. It is a count out. O sea, se pueden contar. Y podemos utilizar how many, too many, too many, a few. Other example. No count now. How much? Eh, a little. Sorry. I own a diet. So I am just going to eat a little soup. Eh, is soup is a no count now. Eh, significa que es algo que no podemos eh, contar. Y the other example, cow now is I need a few sausages for this recipe. It is a few. And the use of a few is for a uh, cow now. Eh, es algo que se puede contar. <coughs> Y podemos usar how many, to many, y a few. It is the question, do you want? How much do you want? For example, the meals. No can now, how much, or too much, or a little. And A, how much? Meal, do you want? ¿Quieres mucha leche? O puede decirse en no too much o just a little. Sí, un poco. O sí, mucho. It is a count out. Eh, algo que se puede contar. Y usted de do you want? Uh, for example, uh, how many cookies do you want? No, too many or just a few. Um, am I finished presentation, teacher? Okay, also a very good presentation, my friend. I like the, uh, uh, it's been your presentation. The images was wonderful. Thank you. Uh, okay, my friend, who is the next one?
¿Quién sigue? Marlon o Marvin. Del micro que no está preparado, ¿no? No, teacher, uh, I'm sorry, I because uh, estaba en otras cosas familiares y Ok, entonces eh, puede pasar mañana, sí, sí. ¿no? Eh, con diferentes temas que sus compañeros no han dicho. Eh, puede pasar mañana. Con respecto sí. a Marvin y Marlon, ¿van a pasar ahora? Yes, teacher. Ok, right. adelante, my friend. Go ahead. Ok. Uh, you can see the screen. Yes, I can. Okay, um, good evening, everyone. Um, I will talk about the topic there is and there are to remember how to use them. Um, let's start. There is, there, uh, there are, and plus a and some any. Para el uso de a o an. Used with countables in singular. Example, there is a plum, there is an apple. Some use with countables and uncountables in affirmative sentence. <clears throat> Example, there is a some sugar, there are some apples. Any use with countables and uncountables in negative and interrogative sentence. Example, uh, there isn't any sugar, there aren't any apples. Is there any sugar? No. Are there any apples? There is, there are, meaning to say that something exists or doesn't exist. There, como se formula? There is plus singular, no? There is, se usará para el singular. There are plus plural num. There is uh, plus uncountable num. Uh, example of there is plus singular num is there is a book on the desk for plural. There are books on the desk for uncountable. Uncountable, there is some milk in the fridge. Para negativas, para sentence negative, negative sentence. There isn't plus singular noun. Simple, there isn't a pen on the table. Or <clears throat> there aren't plus plural noun. Example, there, there aren't any pen, pens here. There isn't uncountable noun. Example, there isn't any use in the bridge. 
for question. There, there is, uh, se cambia el orden para la afirmativa. There is, but al principio, uh, there, uh, but al principio y, y the second. En question, ponemos primero is y luego there. Is there a cat on the chair? Igual con la plural. Are there cats on the sofa? <coughs> Contraction. There is equal. There's equal. There is. There is not equals there is not. There isn't equals there is not. There aren't equals there are not. Uh, aquí podemos ver mm, para hacer preguntas. On how, how many plus plural noun plus are there? How many studying students are there in your class? How many days are are there in February? There is. There are some any plus plural nouns. We use there is. There are to say that somebody or something exists. Se usa para decir que existe algo, que hay algo. We use there is plus a singular noun. Example, there is a book. We use there are plus plural noun. Example, there are books. We use there, there is with a. Or am, for example, there is an apple. We often use there are with some and any. Use some and any with plural nouns. Use some with positive sentence. Example, there are some books on the table. Positive sentence. Use any with negative and interrogative sentence. For example, there aren't any books on the table. Are there any books on the table? And voy a permitirme unos momentos, le voy a compartir otra imagen. Porque esta creo, no sé si la pueden ver. You can see the screen. Sí, se observa. Está un poco borrosa, no sé si la logran leer. Uh, yo leo que dice, there is, uh, there is banana, there is egg, some cheese. Creo que sí se puede ver. Ok. Sí, ok. Eh, vamos a hacer unos eh, ejercicios para ver si hemos comprendido. I complete the correct form of there is, there are, affirmative or negative, and, uh, and, and, some, or any. And the first. A ver, que no viene con la primera. There is, is banana, ¿cuál sería? A, N, some, or mm -hmm. any. This is a banana. There is. Repeat, this please. Is, is, this is a banana. A.
and the second. La última palabra que dije. Ex. Ex. This is an ex. Ok. Uh, and the third. ¿Alguien más que me pueda ayudar en, en la tercera? Hello, you can hear me? Ya no, ya no alcanzo a, a verla. No, la tercera se le dice some cheese. Entonces, ¿qué sería? A, N, some, or any? What no, number? La tercera. Sure. Um, the, there, there, are, are, there are some cheese. Cheese. Cheese or no, no entiendo. There are, but because it are singular, is is plural. Plural cheese. Yes. Cheese. There are some cheese. Okay, and the and the fourth. There is. There is one, a meal, a meal, there is a meal. There is, uh, I put it in some or any. There, mm, any any. Uh, is positive and any non. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. There is a meal. Uh -huh, there is a. One meal. Eh, la quinta, por favor. There are. There are. And the six. Six. Okay, vamos a hacer algo. Eh, Marvin. Esa imagen que usted tiene, tome el screenshot y la manda al grupo. Y todos nosotros en esos 10 minutos la vamos a resolver, ¿sí? Así okay. que tome el screenshot, la manda al grupo y todos me la, me la mandan ya resueltas en WhatsApp. El que no pasó ahora va a pasar el día de mañana. ¿Quiénes fueron? Marlon y Delmi, ¿verdad? Yes. Ok, entonces elija un tema de, lo, de esta unidad, de lo que sus compañeros no hayan he hablado, y ese tema usted expone mañana. ¿Entendido? What, what you need to find? Eh, lo que hemos visto en esta plataforma, cualquier tema, que uh -huh. hemos visto en este nivel. Ok. Ok, eh, por el resto de ustedes, gracias, muy bonita presentación. Me alegro mucho que hayan podido quizás entender un poco más el tema, porque cuando investigamos podemos llegar a entender un poco más. Así que ese es el propósito de esto, que tengan el espacio de hablar, de expresarse, de equivocarse, de repetir, etc. No hay un mal trabajo, todos son muy buenos y la mejora es en el camino, pero tenemos que ser constantes y disciplinados, ¿ok? Así que eh, Marvin, please mande su screenshot. Vamos a resolver todas esas y me mandan al WhatsApp. Los que no pasaron ahora, pasen mañana y see you tomorrow. Okay, bye bye. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night.